Hi guys, it's your girl Luna Legend. and I'm back with another video. Well, I'm still answering um, video requests. Uh, one of my honey bunnies named Kiki. Hi Kiki. Kiki wanted to know what was um, my favorite things um, that, about Whitney Houston in general. So I'm going to name my top 10 favorite things about Whitney Houston in general. Why I love her so much. Well, number one will have to be her looks. Slash beauty Whitney Houston was so gorgeous I could just look at her Non-stop I love looking at photos of Whitney Houston I'm a Whitney Houston photo collector I've been collecting photos since I was a child She is so beautiful Her looks is so breathtaking I love everything about her Her skin complexion Her eyes Her lips Oh just everything Her she's how her stature is she just was everything she was so beautiful aesthetically she was so beautiful she was beautiful inside out but definitely physically Whitney was so beautiful my favorite thing number two about Whitney Houston would have to be her heart Whitney Houston her catalog of music was about love. Whitney Houston had, was so compassionate, loving, giving, caring. I mean, she, you could, that's why I love her. Besides her looks, her personality, just her heart. Her heart was everything. She loved everyone. She, she didn't have like ill will in her heart or her doing. She just was a beautiful, pure hearted person. Yes, she had her problems in life, but she still was a loving, kind woman. And I love her heart. She had a really big heart. Favorite thing number three would have to be Whitney Houston's hair. Oh my gosh. From her modeling days, from her first album cover, from my favorite album is the Whitney album. All her hairstyles. I love Whitney Houston hair. I mean, I love just seeing how it evolved. The colors, the chestnuts, the auburns, the reddish browns. I love the curls, the wet and wavy, the Remy hair. I mean, she had so many looks and they were beautiful. She just, that's why I make, that's why I do inspire Whitney Houston dolls because I love her hair. I love the different looks Whitney Houston had, you know, long hair, straight hair, curly hair, um, pinups, everything. I love Whitney Houston's hair. Everybody love Whitney Houston hair. I mean, those curls. I mean, Alan LaVar did her thing. Tiffany Dixon did her thing. Carl Porter did her thing. I mean, I love her hair. <laughs> Favorite thing number four would have to be Whitney Houston's music. <laughs> I... Oh my gosh, I can get lost in Whitney Houston's music, listening to it all day long from the time I wake up to the time I go to bed, just listening to her songs, reminiscing, what was I doing in my life when that song came out, how was I feeling when the first time I, um, how did I feel the first time I heard that song, or, you know, her music is so timeless, it's beautiful, um, I just like, I just love something. You know, I don't listen to Whitney Houston every day, but when I do listen to Whitney Houston, <laughs> that's why I, I really don't want to listen to it every day because when I listen to it, I want to listen to it all day long. So I have like, maybe if I'm, you know, um, doing my doll craft and I'll listen to a, um, a Whitney Houston like on um, Spotify or um, YouTube or whatever the case may be. I'll listen to Whitney Houston and I'll, oh my gosh, it just... It put me in a trance. Favorite thing number five would have to be Whitney Houston's class. Oh my gosh. Especially in the beginning of her career. She was such a class act. I just love how she carried herself. She was such a lady, a diva in a great, good way. She, the, good, the good attributes of a diva. She embodied all of that. And she just was so classy and and elegant how she you know conduct herself on interviews like it's nothing like saying an interview with Whitney Houston like in 85 86 87 88 even the early 90s not saying um in the late 90s and 2000s that she wasn't still classy but Whitney tried to be a little more urbanized and a little more ghetto wise in my opinion in um the late 90s on up so I didn't 
I didn't. I mean, I still loved it, loved her because you know that was her personality at some times. But I loved the classy Whitney. Not to say like I know her behavior was controlled at times, but I, it just was. It, that's why she was America's sweetheart because she just had so much class with herself, and it just made you want to be a, a great person in life. You know, she was so um, inspiring. She was so inspiring. So, yeah, her class for me would be number five. Favorite thing number six would have to be Whitney Houston's humor. Whitney Houston was funny. She was one of them people you didn't even know she was funny. Just her. She didn't have to be, try to be funny. She just was naturally funny. Um, reading Robin's book, I really saw Whitney Houston's personality come to life and how funny she was. And just, you know, she had a funny sense of humor. She loved laughing. All her close friends always say Whitney Houston love a good laugh. She always love a good laugh. And that's why she is, has such a beautiful smile, always smiling and laughing. And, um, you know, just sometimes sit back just laughing at things. You know, sometimes Robin says sometimes she let this stuff that wasn't funny, but... You know, Whitney Houston had that type of sense of humor. Some things my somebody might thought was serious. She might thought was funny. It tickled her. I got I got some of that sense of humor a little bit too. I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, Whitney was a funny lady. She could have been a comedian if she wanted to. She really even her isms and things like that when she wanted to be funny. Even at the time on being Bobby Brown, she still was funny. You know, that was a dark time in her life, but she still was funny. Favorite thing number seven would have to be Whitney Houston's loyalty. Whitney Houston was a very loyal person. And she proved that with her relationship with Robin, Sylvia, um, other people, close friends and relatives of her. She was just a loyal, even with her brothers. She just, even with her father, even she just was a loyal person. Like you really could count on her That I mean that is just so crazy You know The best female singer in the world And you still can count on her Like to be there for you You know, you understand what I'm saying It's just like She was very loyal Very loyal Favorite thing number 8 Would have to be Whitney Houston's dedication Whitney Houston was dedicated to anything She put her mind to Whether it was her career Whether it was her marriage Whether it was just anything in life She really tried to commit Even rehab She tried to commit at times You know And she really tried to give her all Even if she did um, Wasn't successful in it She still gave it her all And I really appreciate that about Whitney Houston I really, really, really appreciate that about her Favorite thing number nine of Whitney Houston That I love is her charisma Whitney Houston was so charismatic I mean she she was always up for a challenge and i think she she was not built on failure i think whitney houston especially you know trusting and believing in god and coming with a heavy christian uh foundation you know she felt as though you know she could do all things through christ who strengthens her and strengthens us all of us me included and I really admire that about her. She would take on a challenge. <laughs> One of those challenges was dancing <laughs> at a time. But I admired her because she took it on. Especially for the I'm, I'm Your Baby Tonight tour. And last but not least. One of the most important uh, favorite things about Whitney Houston to me is her strength. Even though Whitney Houston had her battles. Even though she had her triumphs, Whitney Houston had strength. She was a strong individual. Because a lot of people going through the things she was going through and, you know, just being pulled in several directions, they would have been crumbled years ago. They wouldn't have had a long, jebby career like she had. They wouldn't have that catalog of work like she had. Whitney was very strong. She was much stronger than what she let on. Like Whitney was a really strong person. Yes, yeah, she had her flaws and did things and, you know, misjudgments. But she was, if she was strong, you know, with that hectic career, a hectic marriage, then you're a mom, 
then you a daughter, then you somebody's sister, then, you know, everybody want a piece of you, a piece of your success, or what can you do for them, and and you still have a giving heart. That's, that's strength, y'all. And then you battle an addiction on top of all of that. Woo! Well, I hope that answered your question, um, Kiki. Um, what are my favorite things of Whitney Houston? Those are my top 10. I have several. I can go on and on. But that's my favorite um, things about Whitney Houston. In the comments down below, y'all let me know what's your favorite qualities or just anything about Whitney Houston in general. And I'll be back for another video. Bye.